That's right, it's another Money Monday podcast right here with me, Reese. And, of course, we was live on the radio a second ago, but right now we're talking about Airbnbs because a lot of people want to get into it. First, you don't need credit. You don't need a real estate license. You don't need a lot of things that you need to gain a lot of rental income as you needed in the past. I got a friend of the show right here. It's San Sharif, a.k.a. Cash Motivating on Instagram. He's going to answer a couple of my listener questions. There's definitely a, a, lot of, a lot of cash to be made on Airbnb. I could definitely see that being the case. There's also a few questions I'll listeners had. Let's go ahead and hit these phone lines. Hey, who's this? Lorenzo, I have an Airbnb up in Seattle. You got to watch out for the homeowners association. They'll turn around and try to sue you because you're you're not supposed to have a business in a quote-unquote neighborhood area or something like that. And the way you get around those is to get licensed with your police station in your county or in your city and they'll basically give you the rights to be able to do that Airbnb or do that short-term rental. Even if you don't have, even if in the CCNRs and the homeowners association say that you can't? When you have a situation like that, they'll try try to keep you from doing it, but if you have the proper legal documents to be able to do it, then you'll be able to do it. It's time to do a little bit of research, because uh, cause if I if I Airbnb mine out for the entire summer, it covers my mortgage for the year. Love that. Appreciate yeah. your Thanks, call, baby. man. See, that's that information we need out there, man. I'm going to let you get them last couple tips, because a few of the tips you had earlier was checking to see other Airbnbs in the area of the spot that you're thinking about Airbnb and to see how often they're rented, if it's a, a popping area, uh, how much, and also creating an LLC and getting your done number so you'll be protected as a business so if somebody does rent from you they can't sue you but you have some other tips you wanted to share with the people number four get you a business bank account don't be intermingling your funds with your personal and your business yep my boy ash cash said it a couple weeks ago about your pleasure account and your bill pay account when you do that the banks are gonna look at you like you can't handle money makes a lot of sense to me let's keep it going get business insurance get the insurance because a lot of times airbnb what they'll do they'll say that you're covered but they're not gonna cover you as much as you think that they would it's Say, for instance, a guest steals something from you, they're not going to be able to really give you anything back for it. And the last thing I would say is you got an action plan, put it together. Now, nah, we're going to hit you for the action plan, bro. Give us your numbers and information. Phone number 404-484-0485. IG, Cash Motivating. C-A-S-H-M-O-T-I-V-A-T-I-N. All right, we got time for one more call. It's Brandy. I have a question about conventional loans. I'm trying to buy a house with a conventional loan, but I want to know if there's any, like, down payment programs that he knows about? Yes, we just talked about this earlier. He was saying that there are down assistance programs and loans that you can get for down payment assistance, but your credit has to be in order. It has to be a little bit higher to qualify for those things. Well, feel free to hit him up specifically about your situation. Okay, okay. Thank you for that. All right, we got a lot of calls coming in, but we won't have that much time, man. So I'm going to let this brother give you his information right now so y'all can get in touch with him and uh, ask him all the questions your heart desires about Airbnb, making that money, and about real estate. All right, what's your IG again? One more time, bro. Uh, the IG is Cash Motivating. That's C-A-S-H-M-O-T-I-V-A-T-I-N. And that's another Money Monday right here with your boy Reese, Money Monday Podcast.